Psalm 145 says this, I will extol thee, my God. I will. From my lips will come ex exaltation and praise to God. O King, and I will bless thy name forever and ever. Every day I will bless thee, and I will praise your name forever. Great is the Lord, and greatly to be praised, and his greatness is unsearchable. One generation shall praise thy works to another, and declare your mighty acts. I, me, I will speak of the glory and honor of thy majesty, and of your wonderful works. And men shall speak of the mighty acts of God, and declare your greatness. They shall abundantly utter the memory of the great goodness and shall sing praise to your righteousness the lord is gracious and full of compassion he is slow to anger and he is rich in love the lord is good to all and his tender mercies are over all of his works all of his works shall praise him the lord and his saints will bless him they shall speak of the glory of the kingdom and talk of his power to make known to the sons of men his mighty acts and the glorious majesty of his kingdom. His kingdom is an everlasting kingdom and thy dominion endures throughout all generations. And I love this portion. The Lord upholds all that fall and raises up all those who are bowed down. And so, Father, all who are bound down, all who are sick, we declare your goodness over them. We thank you that your word says that you are full of grace, you are full of compassion, and you are full of goodness. It says you open your hand and you satisfy the desire of every living thing. And I love that it's every living thing, man, beast, old person, young person, child, saved, unsaved, your desire is to open your hand and satisfy every single person. So Father, we thank you that your hand is wide open and that the word says that your mercies are new every single morning. So Father, I just declare mercy. I declare that people would experience the open-handed blessing of the Lord in their lives in this season. I just pray for all those who are bowed down and those who might have lost their jobs. I pray especially for those in the hospitality industry, Lord, and I just pray that when this thing is gone, that there'd be a real bump in their businesses and that uh, those young people wouldn't lose everything, Father. So I just, in the name of Jesus, I declare a blessing over them. I pray for those kids who are on EI, that their EI would come quickly. But even better than that, Lord, I just pray that this COVID would go as quickly as it came. So, Father, we thank you for your goodness. We thank you for your compassion. We thank you for your mercy. And I thank you today, God, that your hand is open to every living thing. And I will exalt you. I will declare your good works. And I will tell the next generation, I remember God is a really good God.